Hello creative designers, learn how to create a timeline in your website using free resources that is free version for Elementor and we are also going to add a new add-on, uh, an add-on for Elementor which is also free, a free plugin and it will help us to add these features, yeah these beautiful features of a timeline in your website. My name is Peter and welcome on today's tutorial. Let's get into action and get it light. Welcome to my working area. This is my dashboard. And before you go, we need to install some few plugins that we need. A plugin, so we go to plugin, we need this Elementor reversion. And we also need this master add-on for Elementor. If you don't know how to install a plugin, just come to add new on this plugin page. This is where you have the plugin on the dashboard. You have plugin and you can select add new and click. Uh, you can upload a plugin, but you don't have to upload a plugin. So we need to search the plugin that we need. It's called Master Addon for Elementor. Here you have it. It's called Master Addon for Elementor from GL theme. It has more than 7,000 active installation. I updated four days ago before I did this tutorial. So it will have this button which you say install now. After you click install now, it will start installing. After successful installation, it will have activate the plugin, uh, activate button, click on it, and you'll be directed to this page here. After you activate on this section here, the next thing you need to check is the add-on. You click on add-on and find if those are uh, the button which don't have the pro badge you are going to use remember all the buttons which will be active are the one will be available if you want to enable them all you just can click on this section on this button here and you enable them all yeah when you click on it to just activate all of them so the next thing we need to do is you go to the page that you're going to use to create uh, our timeline on so you go to page go to this page I created purposely for this tutorial so on this section we have now the master add-on you can click on it you can see the template they are offering they are offering some very big and a uh, smart huge uh, uh, best template they have this free page you can get them like on this one or this one whichever you want they have the header section footer and some section you can import let's get into this business so what you need to do is you come here and add a section like that uh, stretch the section and pull width after that let's change the background you just come to style and classic choose the color you want i want something lighter somehow something like that something which feature like that yeah on that after that i need to click on this section i need an inner section here and i sorry for that i need an inner section i drag and drop i did this one after that i can increase the width all i can I want it to be like something like 900, let's say 900. After that, now we come on this section, you search for timeline type, timeline. You have this master add on, timeline, and drag and drop. There you have it. These are the sample that came uh, with the timeline. They are there. You can delete them. And you just come to this one. You can add for now the one that you need to use. Yeah, you can add as many as you want. Yeah, you can see there you have them. So, what you need to do is you come from the first one and you can change the content and say um, that I give the first title of your timeline. My first. And maybe my first post like that you can highlight it you can click you can add in bold and you can add a line 
add yeah from there you can even add some point and you can add even add a link if you want to add a link just highlight click on this section here and add a link maybe whichever the link you have and just put a link for the purpose of the tutorial and you paste and click on this so you see you have a link now here so after that you can add a media for this section here so you just have come to media on this and choose the image that you want to use you can use whichever the image you want for your first timeline see doesn't look good uh, you need to increase some size so you can increase like that yeah look good now so from there you can add the column gap you can say maybe no gap on default let's leave it on default so after adding the image now you can style everything you come to the second one and you can also add an image for that you add a media like that you can give a name on it yeah you can give a name on it come to content give my successful my success story if you want to change a date you just click on this section here and you select the date when it happened and you can also add a link to the section that you want to direct them yeah where they can find your success story yeah from there you just come to the next one and you just give it a name and the other one give give a good headline write the content about it and after that select the date when it happened and give a link on that and do it do even then to the last section so we need to add some few picture pictures yeah you just come to this one other one here and you come to media and you add like that there you have your timeline so we need to style our timeline so we need to style you come to style you can set the alignment of the image to uh, where you want it to be let it be on the center you can increase the space in between the image and uh, the header uh, the text the border radius for the image you can add something like 50 yeah you can see this one is visible after that come to layout Pakara, you can add something like green somehow like that and let's add the date and say let it be lead and the background let it be black or you can use this as white one which you see visible for you so from there you have your timeline so you can even add some margin padding and and so and so on you can style it more than you want so from here we need to add our header so we just come to this one and say my timeline Put it on the middle or whichever the section you want to come to style style everything topography you can increase the size i like that yeah you decorate like that you can increase the line height or reduce the line height yeah let it fit let us space in let it be like that and update let's see how it look on tablet that's how it look on tablet and how it look on mobile phone 
yeah you can see that on mobile so that's your timeline only that you have your timeline lady let's go there and we update let's load the page and see how it look like yeah there you have your timeline yeah so that's how you create your timeline hope you did learn something if you did, did learn something hit the like button for this video and subscribe to this channel for more videos to follow thank you